Follow me. Thank the gods we might get some respite. York is lost. We must get as many of our men out as we can. The river. That's the only way out now. We'll get them on the ship from Rome. It's armored, and will withstand anything the barbarians can throw at it. No. They will have to go on the other boats. Commodus and his guard escaped on the warship. They were the first to run. The first out of the harbor, kicking aside women and children as they fled. Status of our defenses, soldier. We're cut off from all districts and trying to hold the bridges, but most of our men have been evacuated. Good. When all our men are safe, we will evacuate on the last boat out. Are you clear? Yes, sir. Marius, this way. Let's get word out. Tell the Senate. What Commodus has done will have to be paid for. Agreed. Damocles was a great warrior. A revered leader in a vast army. His cowardly commanders abandoned him. Nemesis, the goddess of revenge, allowed Damocles to return to the world as a vengeful spirit. A ghostly, black-armored centurion who would hunt down and kill each of the generals who had wronged him. Titus. You are a general of Rome. I brought you here to protect me from Damocles. <laughs> but you are Damocles! <laughs> Gods protect me. You are Damocles! Indeed I am. And my story is almost at an end. I became driven 
by one thought, one solitary desire, the desire for vengeance. Vengeance against the Emperor Nero, who had my family butchered. Vengeance against his despicable sons who betrayed my legion! In order to exact my vengeance, I'd have to return to where my journey began. Return to my home. Danger surrounded me on my journey back to Rome. The evil which had plagued Britain had now infected this city. Starving refugees from our once free Rome lined the roads, telling tales of deprivation and torture. The rule of law lay shattered. My life's solitary purpose was to return to Rome and end the evil that you created, Nero. To prevent you from destroying the Rome that I love and to return it to its people. Praetorians! What's this then? Valiant hero? Battle-scarred veteran of the campaigns? Drop your swords, or I will kill you where you stand. Get him! Don't let him talk to you like that! Have him! Oh, ah! Go on! Go on! Yeah, that's it! Teach that little shit a lesson! Ah! 
blatantly murdered Atticus and Janus! You two, take a look. Nothing. Get back to your post. Yes, sir! I'm gonna have to stay off the streets if I want to avoid trouble. Soldier on the kill, and we're going to find him. You murdering scum! Come on, lads! Hey. Drop your weapons! Yeah! Uh, yeah. 
Fifty. Nine. How many more? About a hundred or so. Up on Beer or Gusty. Someone drew Nero's face and the horse's arm. Not a good idea. Talk about collective punishment. We're burying the whole street. There's no clean water, no sanitation, no bedding, and food! What food? I have to beg for it! You see, Marius, it's not always in distant lands that our greatest enemies lurk. Who are you? Why did this happen? My father was a hero of Rome. Your father was a great general and a popular senator. Too popular, perhaps. The Emperor is a jealous man. A petty man. lived to serve Rome. Emperor Nero serves only himself. He seeks power for the sake of power. He believes himself a god. A cold wind from the north whispered poisonous words in the emperor's ear. Your father and other like-minded men wanted to return Rome to its people. So the emperor had them murdered. After all, that is what emperors do. The spoils of his greed were divided between his sons, Basilius and Commodus. He lavished upon them great powers and responsibilities for which they were unworthy. Rome is failing its children, Marius. You are a vital piece in the game of man. And you, like all of us, have a role to play. Damocles, spirit of vengeance. The fate of the Empire is in your hands. Save Rome. Save Rome from them. Granted by just one man, 
so I paid him a visit. Damocles? I come for the tournament. Ah! <laughs> You're a gladiator. <laughs> oh. Mm, the, uh, the mythical armor is it's a fine touch indeed. You gave me quite the shield. Only the most skilled fighters can enter the tournament. Let me see if you fight as well as you dress. Come, meet me in my quarters. You want to fight for your emperor? And you shall.
Hmm. Here is your scroll of entry. Don't lose it. You've transformed killing into an art form. I, however, express myself in different ways. Hmm. Here is some of my more recent work. I've just completed the final <clears throat> embellishments. It's a gift for my father, the Emperor. It's an amazing piece of work, if I may say so myself. Containing a, a hidden surprise. A small compartment inside the head that will make it cry the finest white wine to symbolize his great love for the Empire. I suppose it could be made to cry anything, really. Anything. Drag down the Senate. The street. The streets of Rome will run red. Red with blood. I've seen you in my dreams. Cut me loose if you wish to know your future. Fallen hero of Rome. Spirit. Of vengeance. slain by the great General Maris. And that general shall be slain by Damocles. But Emperor Nero, he can only die by his own sword. You cannot kill him. 